Hey, what's going on guys? It is Lasty here and welcome to the return of the random pick. Yes, you're, that is right. This is back by popular demand. Most of you leaving comments and leaving me tweets and stuff saying, Lasty, we want to see some random picks. So, of course, I'll bring it back for you. First off, if you guys are looking to buy any coins, check out the thefifashop.co.uk and make sure you use that code LA5TY to get yourselves a nice 5% discount. The link is down below in the description for you guys. So, we go out and we get a page number 10. We randomly generate page number 10 as our first number. Go to that page on the market and we get a Wayne Rooney, 87 rated player, which is pretty good. He looks to be a tank of a card on Ultimate Team as well. Uh, and the the limits we use in this episode is going to be anyone less than 40,000 coins. I thought I could, I could still have a fairly sort of expensive squad, um, but the players we're going to use are going to be relatively cheap. Um, get a page number 12 as our second one, and we end up getting an 86 rated card that is... Carlos Tevez looks to be an awesome card again. Great shooting and great dribbling on this guy. Uh, and then the final one we end up getting is a page 30 or something like that. As we scroll through, we'll get to it eventually. And when page number 30 rolls around, we scroll through and get ourselves an 85 rated goalkeeper. Some people would re uh, well, probably recommend him and say that he's the best keeper on this game. And that is Petr Cech. So hopefully... He could do us an absolute favor. So, we now need to go ahead and build a squad. And obviously, we're going to call this one Random Pick. And the formation that we're going to go with today is going to be the 4-4-1-1. So, looking like a fairly tidy formation. I've not used it before. Um, I don't think so, anyway. So, it's time to give that one a go. Now, I already had a Petr check in my club. So, we go out into the market and pick up ourselves a Wayne Rooney in a striker position for 39,000 coins. Which is a pretty good deal, considering that is... Um, normally the striker versions are over 40, so uh, Tevez in a CF, because that is where he's going to be playing, is about 11.5k, and this is where we're going to be playing each of our players. Obviously in a straight little um, area like that, Tevez at centre forward, Rooney at striker, and then this is the squad that we're going to be playing around them. So um, it's pretty much just Premier League and Serie A, but it's a fairly strong looking squad. I'm really excited to use it. So, obviously, in a goal, we have got Petr Cech. He's got 85 diving, 85 reflexes, 82 handling, and 83 positioning. A really, really solid keeper. Uh, six foot five as well with that traditional save style. So, he looks to be a tank of a player. Then we have Mika Richards and Ashley Cole. Two quite different players. Um, Cole being a little bit slower. Richards being quicker, stronger, and looks all round better to me. Um, then Cahill and company. Both fantastic pace. Uh, decent defending and heading as well. Looks to be two rock solid centre backs. Uh, at left mid and right mid, we've got some tricky players. We've got Nani with the five star skill moves and Willian with the four star skills, but a lot of pace and that afro as well. Um, and then in the midfield, we have got ourselves some Juventus players. We've got Vidal and the up Pogba, who are both looking to be some fantastic box to box midfielders. Can't wait to use them in this squad. Um, so then we have our second random pick player, which is Carlos Tevez. He has got 81 pace, 84 dribbling and 85 shooting four star skill moves and a three star weak foot and unfortunately he's got the high high work rates and um, which hopefully won't let him down too much but that is yet to be seen um and then we've got rooney who again has got the high high work rates and he's not the quickest 76 pace hopefully that won't mean uh, too much of a problem though because he's got 83 dribbling 87 shooting 83 passing and 80 something header headering as well so um this is the squad. It's time to go out into uh, some clips and show you how we actually got on with the team. But all, all in all, it's looking like a tidy squad for about 120 to 130,000 coins. So into the clips then, I've got some initial uh, clips from Petr Cech, obviously being the goalkeeper. Uh, this particular game, this is pretty much where all the goalkeeper clips are going to come from. I was playing some guy who had a pretty much full silver Italian in form squad and he was such a good player. Like, uh, he pretty much absolutely annihilated me. Um, but Petr Cech was managing to keep a lot of the saves out. And as you can see, his reflexes and stuff are top notch. He's an absolutely class goalkeeper. I got on with him so well. And I only lost that game 2-0 to that guy. So it says a lot about the keeper because he had about 30 shots on target. Absolutely dominated me. Um, Cahill getting a header there. And, and Nani picking up a lovely goal as well. Uh, Ashley Cole playing through Vidal. And look at that for a tidy finish. Um, the guy rage quit straight away after that. 
Nani and Willian were both fantastic providers. Uh, and Vidal was obviously up on the score sheet as well. Rooney with a rock-solid shot. Saved by the keeper, I believe, was Petr Cech. Uh, but Willian manages to somehow get it back and tuck it past the keeper. Uh, then Tevez playing that sort of cam role or centre-forward role where he's playing through Willian and he somehow manages to get it past the keeper. I think the keeper completely missed that one right there. Um, the thing that I noticed with this team is that Vidal... Um, Tevez and Rooney all with the high high work rates seem to somehow like all of them were sort of mixed up in different areas all the time and stuff like that it was a bit strange like sometimes you'd find Vidal up front Rooney in defense uh, and it didn't really work too well sometimes but then sometimes you get stuff like that Rooney absolutely bashing it into the back of the net solid goal uh, and the problem I had a lot during these clips um, was that I would win a game like I was playing really well I was winning like 5-0 sometimes and stuff like that but then the problems that EA have been having on the servers meant that I'd win the game it would finish and then it would kick me off uh, leading to me not getting the player's stats on their on their card as you'll see in a moment when we go back um, so it looks like they've done poorly and we also get a loss for it as well which is not the biggest deal but I would really because this is like three mini player reviews I would have really liked to uh, have seen like all the goals that Tevez got for me and all the goals that Rooney got for me on their records because at the moment it looks like they've pretty much done nothing. But clearly from the clips that you've just seen, they definitely were performing well for me. So Petr Cech I found to be absolutely incredible. If I was going to give him a value for money, it would be five stars because you can get the one of the best keepers on the game for 5,000 coins and a 9.5 out of 10 for him. Really, really solid. Probably one of the highest ratings I've ever given on the random pick because he was so good. Mika Richards was class. I didn't really like Ashley Cole. I thought he was a little bit weak to be fair. Um, my centre backs were rock solid. Massive, tall guys. Um, great pace, great defending and great heading. Absolutely rock solid. I love them. Uh, same goes for my box to box midfielders Vidal and up Pogba. They were rock solid. They were very fun to play with. Some great shots from them, some great through balls uh, and they bossed that midfield perfectly. I loved playing with them. Then William and Nani were both too tricky for a lot of defences to handle, especially Nani with them five star skill moves. I found that the scoop turns, the McGeady spins, all of that sort of stuff were were very useful in helping him um, help the team really uh, and then we move on to Carlos Tevez now I I liked Tevez it shows there that he only got one goal and three assists but he did get more because you've seen it in the clips I would overall give him a four star value for money because he's over 10k uh, and an eight out of ten I thought he was pretty good the only thing that lets him down is a bit of height and of course them work rates now moving on to Wayne Rooney the final player of this squad I would go ahead and give him a four star value for money he was an exceptional player actually on this game he is 87 rated so of course um, he's you know he's got his rating and he actually seems to deserve that he seems to play like it as well he's a deadly finisher uh, and I would give him an 8.5 out of 10 really really enjoyed him and that's that's strange for me because I'm a bit of a pace whore and I like my pacey strikers and he isn't quite that so this is the random pick guys it's back so if you can drop a like on the video that would be awesome show your support for me bringing back the series for you uh, I thank you for watching guys and I'll catch you next time peace